Hi, I'm going to show you a visual chart generating an HTML file and then how to build a document onto that session. Here's the visual chart. It's based on this immigration pathways chart which asks various questions to determine whether or not someone is eligible for a green card. That has been converted into a visual diagram and it runs here. Now the bit I want to show you is visual to HTML. Select the file, give it a name, immigration demo and choose where the start node is. We only have one. Give it a name, uh, immigration demo, and it is there. Magic. Visual has generated us an HTML file which will execute the logic in the chart, and at the end we get a determination as to whether or not we are eligible. Because Visual is so clever, we can go back and re-answer some questions and explore other branches. Um, okay, now the bit I want to show you today is if I pick that file up, Immigration Demo, um, I can edit it and add in some extra code to generate a document. So it's in Visual Immigration Demo. I'm going to manually edit it with Notepad. Now notice this is what Visual has generated. Visual has generated an XML data structure which includes all the questions and logic in the chart and it supplies a JavaScript evaluator which walks through that, asking questions as they are reached. Then we have some CSS information which controls the presentation. This is all fairly straightforward if you know what you're doing. In the middle here, I'm going to add in an extra bit of a script which says generate me a document. I save that, get rid of it, get rid of this, and now when I run the demo, do I have a family member? Yes. Are they a citizen? Yes. Are you their spouse? Yes. And now I don't just get a recommendation, I can click on a link and see a generated document. So this is generated from a template we've associated with this chart and it's dynamically assembled using the answers. We answered yes, yes, yes. We didn't answer any of the other questions. The date is there, the time is there, the start note is there, the name of the chart. So this is metadata that is associated with all charts. So that's the end of the demonstration. What did I show you? I showed you initially someone else's logic chart. I showed you how it's presented in Visual. We compiled it into HTML and then we added in the magic script so that we can generate a document at the end of the session. Thank you.